everyone welcome back to my channel so today is a very special day because I'm gonna show you our traditional Greenlandic food I have what I think is one of um, the many traditional foods we have. We have much more, but this is like the main traditional food we eat. And we eat this on special days, birthdays, um, any special day actually, um, or when we're hungry. <laughs> um, this is how we eat traditional food in my family. <clears throat> so it might be different from family to family, from place to place. Let's see what we have. So here it is. <laughs> Start over here. Here we have shrimps. Uncooked and cooked. So they look a bit different as you can see. <clears throat> um, I prefer them cooked or boiled. Um, but yeah, we call them raya. Soya with wasabi. You know, it's just how I like it. And we usually top everything <laughs> with aume here. And here we have quillberries. And yeah, I think I picked these last summer. So yeah. And here we have fermented um, seal fat. <laughs> yeah, we call this orsok or iginok. And then we have whale plopper. A whale. <laughs> and then over here, this little fish is called capelin. Dry. Dried catalin. Capelin. <laughs> Sorry. And we call this one a mesek. And then here we have cod, dried fish, dried cod. Very delicious. Also one of my favorites. Um, this is the whole fish and this is just one big piece of it and then here okay, These are uh, what we call panirtut um, So this is dried fish and this is dried um, What's it called? Seal <clears throat> And then here we have dried reindeer which tastes really good. So yeah Let's get started Okay, so I washed my hands and used the sanitizer, so I'm good to go. What should we start off with? Maybe we should start cutting the whale plopper. Okay, I really hate this smell because it's so strong. It's worth it. I don't know if this knife is good. Let's try to cut it out. I might look struggled. My mom usually do this for me. <laughs> My family, I was used to um, to get this cut out for me. So whenever you get to cut your own metek or anything, I think that's when you feel the most grown up. <laughs> I'm gonna chop it with a homemade. So you just get this off and ah, here and dip it in with the soy and the wasabi. I mean, I mean, this is so good. I know many of my friends likes only some parts of our traditional food because some of it is really strong um, <clears throat> so yeah I think I'm really open-minded about <laughs> about our traditional food I like everything there was a car and this is some um, dried seal mm -hmm. um, you try shrimp this is the 
her window is open because it's a bit <clears throat> warm today. Um, this is the cooked boiled one. You just take the head off, the tail, and just take the rest off. Hmm. <sighs> Try some blueberries. Mm. Let's try the dried reindeer. Can you also hear the uh, raven outside? <laughs> Stop. Stop. It's kind of weird <clears throat> eating in front of a camera. <laughs> the raven. <clears throat> oh, there's two. That's why. So we should try the fermented. Um, seal fat. <laughs> this is very, very, very strong. Not many people like it. And if you get too much, you get that feeling like, like it's too much. You can't handle <laughs> oh, the fat. Here, you can want some salt with this. So. Dried fish. Mm. Let's try the uncooked, unboiled shrimp. I'm just gonna try. Mm. The texture is really different from the boiled one, the cooked one. But it's good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, I forgot about this. I just take the head off, take the tail off as well, and take it in smaller bites. And this fish, all of the insides is already taken out, as you can see. But these small um, fishes, kebelins, they have everything inside. <clears throat> and people, the bone here, they take that off. So I just eat everything inside the fish. Some people also just eat the whole thing. The head, the tail, this. It's really different from person to person, family to family. Is my tongue purple? Mm, it's because of the grill berries. I'm full. I'm happy. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. It was. Um, I hope you take care of yourselves and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.